So now we have 10 Cheese Dojang winners. Of course, Brandon here is one of the Cheese Dojang winners. We'll see if he can add another W to his cheesy resume. <laughs> like in Mobile Horang one where he's doing RFF back too. Uh, I didn't I didn't want it. Oh no wait, that's already in the game, right? Never mind. Alright. Woo! That was short. Like my cheese. It was short from winning a set. <laughs> one, two, three. Steve, count count to four with Steve. Ouch, damn bathroom. Okay. We'll move in it. Back dash. Ouch, do you have to? Wait, he's left, right? Why am I stepping right? I forget all these details. Details. It's, it's the tournaments are coming up. Remember, Frontier. Remember. <laughs> remember the details. Oh, nice. Chipping away is Brandon. There you go. Getting the hop kick versus the down two. Extending the combo with DF4-1. Oh, and getting the full max damage on an F3-4. That is one of the ways to get really, really big damage with Miguel, ladies and gentlemen. I like how I know that just because I play Miguel. If I didn't play Miguel, I'd be like, yeah, that's like one of the strongest damages, right? <laughs> Ouch. Really? Very well, then. Ouch. Back one. Plus three. Boom. Surprise. One, two, three, four. Count to four with Steve. Albatross two. You wouldn't believe it, but before I couldn't do the alb combo. Like flick one into alb, I couldn't do that before. I struggled so hard with it. <laughs> it took me like months to get that down. And I remember when I got it down, one of my teammates was saying, it took you that long? And you can do all the complicated stuff with Huang. I don't believe you. <laughs> I don't know, it's weird. But that's like just learning yourself as learning more about yourself as a player. That's very, very important. Oh punish. Skyrocket. Yeah, I'm dumb. I'm dumb. And I'm gonna go not to the wall. He was sidewalking though. I thought there was like gonna be a setup or something. Ooh, we're getting it. Oh there, I couldn't get it again. I'm so dumb. Axel, hello, hello, hello. Huang XP, yes! But there are two, there are two, there are two. <laughs> there are two people ahead of you. So after this first to five, I have to play two more first to fives and there's someone else who's gonna catch up. So it's more or less who's, uh, still, who's still available during that time. Oh no. But yeah. If you are game after three first to fives, which will take some time, then I'm game as well. Again, for as long as we can connect, that's what the cheese dojang is for. Or if you want to reserve your slot for next Friday, you can do that as well. Because there's a reserve, there's someone who reserved the slot for this Friday. But he's not here at the moment. Ouch. Oh, it's Apple for he's going for the Oki now. He's not going for damage. Man. Man, what am I doing? What am I doing? Okay. So basically, I have better movement, but no neutral to speak of. And the most obvious jab to DF1 in the game. <laughs> okay, so my Horang's still slightly better on a break, I guess. Maybe it's just Steve. I don't know, I'd have to swap to another character. You can wait? Alright, no problem, man. So that's game number one for Brandon. Because I don't trust their offense as much. <laughs> Even if their offense is really good. It is. They are very good. Like Steve's. I have to hang, hang in the middle. Do my thing. Oh no, that's an 11 frame back one. Essentially like Leroy's, but people don't talk about Miguel's. Because Miguel's range is kind of iffy. Ooh. And it's short too. Gotta stay in the middle. The shimmy. The down two. Okay. He's doing the jabs into the F1. We're both doing a bunch of mid checks. Sav two. There you go. Ooh. The hop kick whiffed and it spelled the end of his cheese. He needs sleep after that. But we'll see. It's just the second round and the second set. Second game. Second game of the second set. Here you go, DF1. Asserting dominance. Getting that. Okay, there you go. That's what I was expecting. Ooh, he's willing to challenge. And there's not challenge there. I did not call it right. I did not have the read. However, ooh. Bup, bup. Good blocks. We'll see if he whiffs. No whiffs. I do have rage. That's what I am looking forward to. 
Well, that hit the wall. Fantastic! We'll take our plus frames. And we lost it. Oh. He can't use the plus frames there. That's how bad Miguel's cheese rage drive is. No! Alright, interrupted those plus frames. Could he have used... Yeah, he could, he could. He could. Okay. Full crouch. No. One, two. Stay in the middle. Interrupt. Ouch. Oh, wait, I'm consistent. I'm one of the characters with a consistent punish for that. That's down 3 plus 4. That's uh, Miguel Steel pedal. It's negative 14, but it's got lots of pushback. So Steve is one of the characters who have a very consistent punish versus it. Because his Sonic Fang reaches to the ends of the earth. Or the ends of this pool and beach. Ouch. I was not ready for it. Not ready. Ooh, that's not NC. How do, how do you deal with lag switchers? You just really got to, usually just got to steer clear of playing against them. That's the most you can do. So win or lose, just leave the match already. Exit to warm up or if you're encountering them in like rank, switch to quick match or get out of like a certain rank because that's the rank they're on, right? Or you can beat them at your own game. It's a, it's a whole learning experience as well to beat, to win in lag because the, the skills required are different. Yeah, or technically they're not as different, but the emphasis on those skills are higher. Like thinking ahead and reading your opponent. Because you can't react as often since there's lots of lag, right? Or lag switching. I wasted that. <laughs> press! He did press. Just not the wall standing four kind. To, you know, to get counter hit. He knew it. He was ahead of me. Let's see. That was negative 10. I'll take that. No. Let's see. Boom, Sav 2. Oh, wait, that's not Sav 2. That's Flick 2. But I'll call it my Sav 2. My Sav 2. Never mind. Hop kick. Will he get these short wall splat? He does with the Sav 1 1. Down back 2 to get that maybe. Safe mid option, safe mid check. Here you go, the down back threes. Will he press there? He does not. Good job steering clear with back dashes. However, the whiffs while standing one, just trying to catch. And there he gets it. The walk in to have down 4 3. So he's going up. But I don't recommend doing the second option. I, I do recommend doing the first option, which is steering clear, switching modes, and just basically have, being able to get games that are worth playing. Ouch! Ouch! Stop jabbing me. It's like, it's like telling someone to like, hey, stop playing Tekken. Yeah, stop playing Tekken, please. I'm, I'm <laughs> Boom, slam dunk. And just like that, I got what I deserve. Bang! I should have not moved. Bang! Hatchet kick. Slapper, slapper on the legs. The 235 to the 677. Here you go, BTR taking it. He does not need sleep at the moment. Gonna get the wall, maybe. There we go, getting the full extension. Ooh, not the full extension. However, he has the wall pressure on him. Miguel showing it. He's got the 12 dubs. He owns he owns a dozen more of cheese. No ducking there. Oh yeah, the last time we did play, I was doing a lot of that, huh? He knows. The movement. The movement from Brandon. Here he goes. Just like Sav 2, I'll do Alb 2. Oh, there you go. That's the switch. That's positioning. He didn't want that throw. It's just for positioning. He can run away. There's 20 seconds. Ahaha. Ha. Ooh. He's got to keep it. Got to stay within range. Woo! No! Alright. Did I press a button? I'm dumb. But I'll take it. What's Miguel's fighting style? He's very poke, very poke aggressive based. So you could make it poke aggressive, poke neutral, or poke defensive. He can do it all, but it's mainly poking. Very very poke based. Whether you want to make that offensive, neutral, or defensive is all up to you. He can do all. His punishment's kind of on the slightly inconsistent side, but. Once you know, mo know most of the punishes, most especially the ones that are inconsistent, 
you're, you're you have a really strong character in your hands, and he has one of the best movements for males as well. Wow, he got that. Oh no, that could have spelled the end of me. But we live on. That does not work. I am not a Steve player. <laughs> I use the combo that. Oh, no! kick to the face to the boot with another boot. Woo. I mean, Sav mix-ups are strong. You do have to press Sav sometimes. You hear Brandon's doing a clear, good uh, show of it. Here, if you want to see more Miguel, you can check out his other mods here. Vods. Vods! Mods. <laughs> In the cheese dojang. Is he the only Miguel I've played? I think there's him and another. At least on stream, right? Okay, that would have wall splat. Mm hmm. We'll take that. Oh, you're gonna press there. You're gonna press there? Never mind. Never mind. <laughs> he wasn't gonna press there. He's gonna go up 3 0 now. Abandoned with big statements. Everyone is showing up their. Stay safe, stay safe. Use your Huang. I already used them. I, w I was just checking if my subs were any good. Because I'm rusty. Rusties? It's an actual brand. No, it's not. <laughs> it's a fictional brand. You know, from Cars. If you watched Cars. That was a mix up. Okay. Surprise. Never mind. He knows that. Bang. Press. I'll take that. What does Miguel have? No, he can do just F F2 1. F21 would reach that. That's what I like about F21. They, they, what do you call this? It reaches a lot of stuff. Or no, technically, it reaches a lot of stuff that Magic 4 would reach as well. It's just that its range is slightly shorter than Magic 4, but its rewards way better. So if there's something that both Magic 4 and F21 could hit, punish, you should just always settle for F21. Carl loves cheese. Yes, the cheese is struggling. He's not winning any cheese dojang matches today. <laughs> Everyone saw the cheese dojang winners and they're like, I gotta get on that Hall of Fame. <laughs> I gotta get on there. I gotta get on there. Oh, whoops. Ouch, he did not do a low. Whiff, please. Whiff, please. Whiff, please. Whiff, please. Whiff, please. Oh, well, it didn't whiff. It connected. That's the best thing that could happen to him and the worst thing that could happen to me. That is negative 15. Guess what? I just pressed 1, 1, 2. I could have pressed Sonic Fang. This is the problem when you... <laughs> Got it. Alright. Gotta stay in the middle. That's what, at least what I've noticed. Stay in the middle. Alvin loves cheese, yes. Playing a lot of cheese today. And so many people wanting to play the cheese today. Oh no. Okay. Okay. Back two. Awesome. That's how you do it. In cheese fashion. That's peak gameplay. Oh no. Yeah, that's peak gameplay. Slam dunk. It was all part of the plan. No, I'm joking. <laughs> I was lucky there. Ouch. Stop. Stop. There you go. Thank you. Oh, I got it wrong. Pa. Galing. Punish. Oh, that's bad. Okay. That's essentially like, what do you call this? His Sav 1 down 1. Oh, Sav 1 1. Because in Steve's, it's Flick 1 down 1, right? It's essentially the same. So you have to be very careful after, what do you call it? Sav 1 1 unblock. Just like you have to be careful after Flick down 1 1 unblock. I'll take that punish. All right, finally a game. Is there a queue for the first to five? Yes. There's... It started like after two intervals. So maybe essentially six. So maybe 806. What have you all been doing? How do you get good at this game? I oh, know, I'm just asking. <laughs> Bang. That's me. I'm doing it. I'm... 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 <laughs> No, I don't know how. <laughs> I don't. 
and I don't want to learn how. Ouch! Nice, beautiful duck. Okay, that's zero. And another thing that you have to watch out against Miguel is that most of his lows are plus. Most. Most, most of his lows. So you can't exactly press. You have to think, you have to take care in your challenging. Because you can't give all of it. Really, that didn't work. Didn't work. Will that work? Yay. So that means this will work. Never mind, that was too obvious. <laughs> Ah! Oh! Press! I gave up my rage. Down jab. Ah. I don't have a flippy. I don't have a flippy. <laughs> ah! I did not have a flippy. He got me. Big life lead advantage. Uh huh. One, two. Oh no, the down back one. The Miguel, the Miguel sneak. Here you go, salve pressure. See, this is this is offensive, poking, sir. Whoa. And of course, that's like in rush down form. You could also do it in just spacey form. There are many ways to do it, but more or less Miguel can do it if you ask him to. Pep. Okay, getting somewhere. Or not? Maybe? Who knows? Yay! Five slices of Parmesan cheese. Next thing you know, it's feta cheese. Down two. While standing one, one. Okay. Now I'm back to three plus four. He's using a lot of the generic lows. Which is, you know, helping him pile up a lot of stuff since he's winning it neutral more than I am. He's able to dictate the pace with that. Oh, that's negative 13! You're telling me I'm a frame slow? I guess so. I missed it, but I just Sonic Fang because it was a whiff. It was a whiff. Just use your whiff punisher, bro. We'll see. Got time. It's like 30 seconds. Haha. <laughs> My punishment is off. Then again, it was off with Hoarang as well, so I kind of expected that to transfer over. Nice. I'm alive. Down four. Down four. Down four. Down four. All right. Finally, I caught a whiff. <laughs> Is that the first whiff I caught? I didn't even catch a whiff against Zyron, did I? I did not. Huh. All of you are playing safe today. Press, please. Thank you. I'll be on my way to check out. <laughs> yes. Yes. Nazim, he loves cheese. That kind of cheese getting the slam dunks every time. Will Brandon move onwards to do set point? Or will he falter and drop the crowbar and knife he has to the boxer, the brawler, who clearly is not in a ring? Well, technically, this is a ring, right? Ah, magic four. Yes, but no combo. Yes. I could have low parried that, but <laughs> as well, but I don't have a read on it. Just like uh, Zyron's, what do you call this? Parries. One, two, shimmy. One, two, shimmy. Okay, I'll take that. One, two. Backdash. One, two. Count to four with Steve. <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. Okay, that's unsafe. I should be doing back to one. No, not back to one. Two. Uh, wait, back to one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's negative 13. But to be safer, I could just do two one into flicker. Or like that. Will he step? Alb 2. Flick 2 for mid checking. Alright. What am I doing right? I have no idea. I'm just pressing buttons sometimes. <laughs> I just know that I need to stay in the middle, and that's literally all I'm doing. Just staying in the middle as much as I can. Oh, I'm blocking lows. That's what happened. That's it? Yeah, it can make a big difference. Shouldn't underestimate being able to block punish. Nah. So now it's three all apiece. All right, so I guess the adjustment worked, even if I have no clue. I do understand the struggles it takes to make Mokujin, because you know he basically he copies the moveset of everyone else and he has his own properties. 
So maybe not adding him now. But they could, but I guess they just won't. Plus three. One, two, three, four. Count to four with Steve. Okay, salve two. Mid check galore. Ooh. Will I be playing it evil online? Yeah, I will be. I'll see how far I can go. It's essentially the same with Tekken Online Challenge. If I'm not ready, if I'm still like this, then I'll expect to like lose early. But obviously I won't want that, so I'll be practicing. Oh. When is it again? Sometime in August. So it's pretty close already. At least for us, right? East Asia. One, two, three, four. Ah. Time, time. It was time again. I was rushing everything. So I can't wait too long. I need to cap myself at a certain time in order to, what do you call this? Make sure that situation does not happen. Can't have it all happening all the time or else I'll be always just losing. Off time offs. Hey, DF1. DF1. Down one. Oh, we got that one. DF1. Just to check so that he doesn't do a down jab. Okay. That's, that's negative. But uh, yeah, you could cover that with a power crush. Ooh. Oh, that was long. Mid-August. Will I be in time? I have no idea if I'll be able to do it in time. That means I just have to play all the time. But I don't want to play all the time. Because <laughs> I'm... A lot of my time actually just getting being eaten up by just editing videos. Editing videos. Uh, thinking about new content. Making memes. <laughs> like all my time's being eaten up there. The only times I usually get to play are in the one-off times I play online. Like yesterday. Or, you know, Cheese Dojang. Because usually in open hole lessons, I don't play. I usually don't play. Because that's reserved for like, you know, talking about stuff. Tekken stuff. So that's why Cheese Dojang is so invaluable uh, to me as well. So if it's valuable to the viewer, it's valuable to me as well. Like, to, to, I, can't, I can't like not have this. This is like my only source of gaming right now. Uh, one, two. Zero on block. They just had to make that zero on block. Okay, okay, okay. Chip in, chip in away. Okay, so that means, what do you call this? I can get, I can get, what do you call that? Duck forward tuna. I missed it! I'll take that. I'll take that too. Hop kick, hop kick. Oh. So the interrupt. Oh, we got that one. Yeah, I'm getting beating, just getting beat by the power crushes. Is he gonna walk Sav? Eh, <laughs> while standing for Japo, wake up while standing for. So now he's at a, he's now at set point. Four in this first to five, Brandon can close it out in this set. The slow, steady pace with interrupting here and there is working out for him perfectly. Here you go, just getting it. F4, not exactly an optimal follow-up. Still got a follow-up nonetheless. Down 2-1. Here you go, gang for the jabs. That is unsafe, ladies and gentlemen. However, Miguel does have a safer extension in DF1-1. So mixing those two together, you have to be able to be on your guard to block both. Oh no, back one did not fit there. Here you go, catching with the DF1s. That's zero on block. Again, south 4 is zero on block, but it's a high. Here you go, zero. Doing a bunch of mid checks again. Mid galores from both players. Oh, standing one two. There you go. He got the forward two one. All right, he got it. He got it. Are you all listening while playing at the same time? I don't do that. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Ooh. So, if I was able to get wins by blocking lows, he's now blocking lows. No. Alright, so yeah, the answer is the chip with lows. Okay, no interrupt there. Yeah, so generic down four is really, really valuable. However, do not let them press a button after generic down four as much as possible. Because it is negative on hit. You can, you can control it, essentially. Oh no, I have to do something. 
Whiff, whiff. Man, if that hit, I would have gotten a big rage dive combo. Count to four with Steve. Down jab. Yay! Did I get lucky there? I most likely did. Round three. Still moving on. These these sets are going long. Yeah, that is the button you can press. He's being very, very patient. Is that obvious? Is it obvious? Okay. There you go, he got it. And now he has one more round. Very, very methodical in his offensive approach. Uh-huh. Negative. I'm lucky there. <laughs> like, the last hit actually hit. It connected. Jab. Ooh, sidestep, hop kick. The realignment from the buff of down back two. Here he goes, he's gonna get the full wall. Whiffing with the last hit. Sav two. Here you go. That's negative 10 and I missed it. Could have just low parried that, but sure, why not? Still, it's still punishable. Here you go. We're back in the same situation again. That is launch open. Oh no. Damn! All lows? Okay. I live to see another day. I have enough cheese in the tank, it would seem. Okay. He's taking the damage and just chipping away. See, this is a different kind of uh, style he's using, sir. He's, he's done a lot. Done various styles of Miguel in this uh, first to five. There he goes, going back to the aggro portion of it. We'll see if he'll go back, revert to... Neutral, maybe. I'm dead. I'm alive. Never mind, I'm dead. And just like that, good games to Brandon. Good games.